Chilling words from a heartbroken father as he addresses his son's killer in court. Today, a sentencing hearing for Michael Mosley. Mosley is accused of stabbing three young men outside of a Midtown bar in 2019. That includes Clay Bethard. I think I speak for the family and Clay when I say that we are grateful for what God is doing in this tragedy. Well, Stephanie Langston was inside the courtroom. She joins us live with more on that emotional testimony, Stephanie. Well, the strength of the survivor and the victim's families in this case, along with their ability to forgive the killer, is nothing short of remarkable. Michael Mosley is convicted of killing Paul Trapini III and Clay Bethard after stabbing them both in the heart and injuring A.J. Bethurum after stabbing him in the face. This was all outside the Dogwood Bar in Midtown just days before Christmas in 2019. Today, Bethard's father, Casey, addressing Mosley in the eyes, pleading for him to find God and sharing the family's prayer that one day perhaps his son's killer and his son will be friends in heaven. The last thing my, my daughter, my, my son Clay's best friend said before the trial started weeks ago that we didn't want to put her through because she's, she's enduring in the Lord. But she said, and I'll leave you th with this is that, and this is our prayer. Tatum said, wouldn't it be awesome? If Clay and Michael could become great friends in heaven. And that's our prayer. His words leaving the room in awe and Mosley's family in tears. Mosley faces a life sentence. Now, for the first time today, Mosley also took to the stand apologizing to the family and calling his actions impulsive. We'll hear from him coming up on News 2 at 5. Reporting live from the Birch Building, Stephanie Langston, News 2.